will save me. And maybe, maybe that ballsy stuff will ma uh, make an opening for him. Exactly, yeah. And he's, uh, you know, worst case scenario, you know? you know? The best case scenario is perhaps, you know, if you're charging up Smash at like, I don't know, 140%. It doesn't matter, you know, you can still do it. It's all good. So let's go UK against Netherlands. Final destination. Yeah, we've got, ah, so far it's been, you know, we've had, we had these strange passive plays, the fluidity, you know, switching between these two in the center, two on the sides, you know, both taking up one half of the, of, of, of the, uh, of the stage so far. Just, you know, getting into a brand new game. Those, like, the first half, a half a minute to a minute is very formative still, you know, a part of a game. I love what JP tried to say really close from Ken H. Like really, really close. If there is an opponent in between them, it does not go. But if they're close, I feel like he tried to just stick. But be careful life, just walling a bit that Ike Warriors taking care of that pitch. Oh beautiful Nair by JP. Also, I think to note to, to just to note about this, these uh, characters about a couple of their gimmicks. Um, you know, the, the Netherlands players are very low in profile, but also they have the uh, longevity in PK Psy Shield, uh, or the the, 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 the the Psy Shield rather, uh, to recover HP. Uh, which is going to be, you know, when they have those breathing time, those, those, that, that breathing time, you know, they're going to knock their opponents away, heal up. Do you know how much it heals? From one tiny bubble of uh, electricity? Uh, from a, a thunder jolt, I, off the top of my head, I don't know, but um, I think the, the big thing is using thunder because when the thunder strike comes down, you can actually like um, you can absorb that, and that's a lot. That's like, I think I, I think anywhere between twenty, I think. Is uh, yeah, quite. it's like the double of the normal person, something like that, right? Yeah, yeah, something like that. Yeah. All right. I don't, I don't quote me on that. I don't I haven't actually looked at the exact heal amount. Uh, I should do at some point for future reference. Ah, I love GB. He was just pushing away by the nest, but just, okay, okay, I'll let you the stage. Kennedy is here to save me. And still with his stock, which is really important because Pick Up Life also gets his third stock full. But full. And it's not. Oh, oh, green team loses S first. Very nice stuff from S1. Yeah, that grab was important, definitely. Nice. There's, there's the net. That'll, that'll be it. Does hit, hit Carnage, but worth that kill on Pick Up for Life. No need for rage. All percent, all percent of uh, on Ike. I mean, one one fifty percent on the on the Pikachu. But I mean, I mean look at the back. Oh, such a big hit, and and Ness goes flying down to a uh, three stock to four now. Carnage on one twenty one, one thirty. Um, gonna be cl getting closer to that. So c GP's gonna want to look after his princess. Yeah, GP on the ground. Kenich just flying around. Yeah, I do love that. I do love that. Oh! Ooh, shielded by Carnage, spot dodged by S1. Nice. Chase mm. the rainbow. Oh, that's unfortunate getting grabbed by a, a nest. No, no, no. Not at 8%. <laughs> this is so dangerous. I love how JP is just on the ground to catch all the landing while Ken H is just flying around and catching the jump. Nice. Yeah, nice falling up air. Didn't get get the kill, but it wasn't. It, it was kind of just a setup. It was a. It was more like um, reassurance for the future. We can do that. I, I feel like he didn't want to make an up air first, but he reacts to what happened. So okay. Oh, could be dangerous. Oh! No, Forest Team partner. Oh, oh. Okay, but GP <laughs> gentleman as he is, just sending Kenny off stage. Yeah, get away from all of the danger, my lady. This is important now for Carnage to maintain his stock because if yeah, one has to be taken, it's an immediate. It's, 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 a bit, it's a bit bigger than you think. Nice job by Ken H. Oh, the that's. 33, it looked like. <laughs> it may not have been that much. It may just be. It was a lot. Oh! Beautiful, beautiful. She has to look immediately. Now, as you can see, G GP immediately going back. And she, oh, nice. And GP can't get grabbed. Oh, he can't yeah. get Beautiful jack down by Pika for Life. I think it was. There it is, the fair. This is it. Now, this is where the green team needs to start their, their combo potential. Now, Pikachu is still very, very difficult to catch. He's still fast as all hell. Fortunately for green team, this is Ike with the rage. Which means <laughs> any kind of move can deal the stock and the match. He's <laughs> like, this is Ike with rage. Next hit. <laughs> Touche, sir. Well said. Well said. <laughs> but yeah. I think the big, th the big thing there was that PK Thunder two onto onto PK for life from S1. Yeah. That was a really unfortunate play. Um, I think that was kind of the, that was the big turning point in that game for uh, Green Team. 
uh, to take that forward. Yeah, I do think like <coughs> if those kind of stuff happen at the beginning of the game, you can manage to make it back. But if that happens at the mostly at the end of the game, you're gonna have less and less stock, so you won't be able to just survive longer. Mm. I don't know if that was really clear, but it's just like you got three stocks. Okay, my op my partner killed me once. I still got two, so even. If I lost another one, I still have another, so I still can try some stuff. But if it was my second stock, for example, now now I'm down on my last stock, so no more mistake allowed. Yeah. And that was that kind of moment. So yeah, yeah, that was a turning point. I do yeah. definitely agree. Uh, yeah, I mean, for sure. So smash wheel now. Okay, let's go, let's go. I like that because there is a, I, I, I mean, mainly because of the horizontal pressure from these characters. We've got, you know, the Thunderjolt that bounces along along the floor, the PK fire that you may not see as much, but, you know, they do have this kind of like, this lateral um, kind of attack set, um, you know, and, and they can use that one single platform to their, their, their advantage as well, um, by, you know, especially when they're working together, um, with like, you know, the throw combos that, that they have, you know, maybe being able to get earlier kills from throws with, with someone like Nest, for, for, for example. And also, I mean, it can allow a little bit of um, displacement from the aerial to ground, um, uh, like, um, variability from the green team as well. Just kind of, just having that in the middle can be a little bit of a displacement. Yeah, I know what you mean, I know what you mean. But for now, I do feel like blue team gets more control. Not that much, though, but they do get a bit more. Yeah. Okay, that nice was a, try. Yeah, I mean the parasol is mighty powerful in this one. Um, power soul. Oh, oh. beautiful, tiny Dombey to just switch a bit of his uh, his momentum, his timing. Finding uh, that up there was really important. The really. kid's got a massive head. Let's not lie. <laughs> That's true. Jeez. Oh, that don't be neutral. No, I won't reach the Ness. He went for the two frame, but didn't get it. There's that uh, PK fire coming in. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, nice double jump. Jimmy was ready, but PK for life was also ready a step ahead. Ah, mm. uh, green team in the lead. GP ready to make the wall on the Ness. Pikachu, Pikachu making a really great co comeback on stage, allowing them to take back the control and beautiful back here. Yeah, no, no, nice conversion. Just seeing that was there and the forward rush as well. That was a big kill. That is the final stock now for Carnage. The Taste of Rainbow comes out. Falling the GP got or still got his three stocks. Stay spike on two. Pika for life as well. And okay. There goes Ike's first one. So three to two. Three, three to four, rather. Um, doable, doable. But it's a PK for life. Oh my god! The S1, I, say I it? wanted to say. I'm Did sorry. Did I say it? Did I say it? Use that platform, get an early kill from those throws. There it was. That is a huge, huge early kill for Blue Team. Now it's going to be harder to make it back. It's Oh my god, this is scary, man. Blue team definitely on the control. Look at the, look at the green team always sending upward. They cannot reach the ground. They can't, they're not allowed to. Ah, oh, beautiful by S1. One, the other, back on the first one. And you can see that they're kind of moving with it. You know, you have these two, these two blue characters just pushing back and forth, pressuring one side, pressuring another. They are always in sync together. Oh, good try. Oh, that dash tech to cover the landing of the beach. Oh! Hello, Ness. Bye-bye, Ness. But now, one, 140 percent. Can that need to be really, really, really safe? One grab and this is it. One grab from Ness, I mean. Yeah. Like this one, maybe? No, okay. Dangerous position. How oh, this one? Okay. GP alone. Oh. No tag. That was it. That was it. Uh, <laughs> uh, I guess like the kind of character that like, make the two v one even more harder. Yeah. Because he's so slow. So any move that he, any move that he makes, even if he reach an opponent, the other one can come and punish it just right after. This should be really, really, really hard. Or he needs to get everything in his favor to reach maybe. Both of them in the same way, mm. be huge. 25, yeah. 25 percent. Smashville's platform, man, it goes out very, very far. And the thing about it as well is that Smashville's got very, very uh, thin side blast, zone, um, bl blast zones, if I'm not mistaken, yeah. Uh, 
Yeah, they, yeah, are, yeah. they are the thinnest in the game in terms of the legal um, stage set by quite a margin as well. Um, and, also it, and, it, and because it's the shortest, it kind of makes up for that. But then you have this platform that goes beyond it. That's the most important thing about it. This platform goes so close to the blast zone. Um, man. But the one thing, that was the counter pick of the Netherlands. But now, UK bring them on their own. But they go back on final destination. A little bit we'll of a, see. a little bit of a longer stage again, just to kind of. Uh, I think they're hoping just to kind of spread out these two because when they're close, they are dangerous. We have this, as I said, these two viable creatures moving to the left and the right and in sync. If you can try and get in between that by opening up the space between them, perhaps you'll be able to control the two of them better. And I do think also if they pick a stage like Battlefield, could have been a bet because. Even Ike can be good on the ground and staying just under the platform to make some up tilt or that kind of stuff. Pikachu is really good on platform. Yeah. So it could be like kind of a bet. So I do understand why they just go back on Final Destination. No platform, no anything. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, Blue Team gets more mobility. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Platform would have been a bad idea, in fact. Yeah. And also, I mean, Carn um, Carnage Peach, um, very, you know, re just really, really solid. No, no, not saying not solid uh, on platform, but very solid off, you know, without platforms as well. But because of how much aerial, um, you know, ability she has, you know, the float is so powerful. And, and you know, fair, the crown hitbox is nuts. Um, a really strong move. Being able to kind of like not have platforms get in the way of that. Important. There's the heal. I love that. Just, just what? Two seconds? They're ready for that heal. They're ready for that heal. Beautiful! And they say, yeah, you, you get rid of one and it's just so quick, it happens so easily. Yeah, oh. because the Thunder came out so fast also. Yeah, and that's definitely like, about strong communication. It's just saying, it's just saying go up. Go up and there's, and there's the Thunder. So, big lead. S1 making such a great work also. Oh, you are a high person? Okay, I'm coming to grab you. I'm here, man, I'm here. Beautiful way to finish the stocks. This is where they got to get these two away from each other. You know, as I said, together they are so powerful. I can tell, like, can I really try to get in? But they got real lots of trouble. Because the point is, he gets in, but always getting encircled by blue team. So it's always hard to really find opening because both of them are ready to punish them. And GB always trying to stay just a bit behind, but for that kind of thing, this is perfect. Nice. Yeah, I think if I. Yeah, just. Controlling that center stage. Peach going flying again. Got to be careful. They need to get rid of this stock from Pika for life as well. He is holding on to it. Night just going over the 100% market. Five, you know, two and a half minutes into this first, into this third game. Oh, nice by GB. Oh. That was a try. That was definitely a try. That was a right fish. Oh, still living. But S1 is ready. Oh, beautiful side. Just under that tiny thunder. That's it. There we go. Get that follow up. That. Team combo with a kill throw. They are even stuck now. Not in person though. He's really dangerous. Oh my god. I think, I think it was 13% for healing. 14. Yeah, 13, 14. It's like the fourth one. So 40% around, maybe 50, maybe more. He gets healed during only that game. This is important. This is quite half a stock around. I mean. Yeah. A fish. Okay, both of the green team are completely separated, but finally finding a way, but that back here will not kill Ike. Oh, oh that was definitely an error. Oh, that that was, was huge. That was unfortunate. I okay, guess so now can I alone again those four stock and one that can be healed. This is doable, but this is a task doable, I would say. Can it really need to be perfect? And that's gonna be so hard, man. So especially hard. against players of, of S1's caliber and Pika for Ice caliber as well. Oh, ah, <laughs> nice. Mm, a so nice, nice Pika for Life. Just throwing some quick and fast move just to block the pitch and shield, allowing S1 to go back on stage safely. Oh, it's scary! Yeah, that's fair though. Strong move. Watch out for the head. <laughs> it's a big head that kid's got. But can it not give up at all? He does not! You wouldn't want to. Well, winner's oh. side stock on the line. There it is. 
Nice, nice play from the Netherlands. A good opening game from, from the UK players.